Hello and welcome to my channel. In this tutorial I will show you how to create a basketball in Adobe Illustrator. We will go to the shape tool and create a perfect circle by holding down shift. Then we'll change it from fill to stroke. It is important that the circle is exactly in the center of the artboard. Next we will go to the pen tool and create a straight line in the middle of the circle. Hold down the shift so you can create a perfectly straight line. It will have a smaller value in size. Then we will create a copy of the circle that we will move to the right and we will pull the top to flatten it. After that we will overlap with the other exactly in the middle. We will go to the scissors tool and press on the sides of the flatten ellipse and delete the bottom. We will click on the paintbrush and we will choose fidelity to smooth. Then we will create an S letter so that the middle curve passes through the dividing line. We will make sure that the bottom overlaps as much as possible with the bottom line of the circle. Then we will change its diameter so that it is slightly smaller than the middle line. We will create a copy of the curved line by pressing Shift and Alt and we will drag with left click to right. Then we will right click, transform and reflect horizontally. We will group them both, then the rest of the drawing and center them. We will select everything, we will go to the object from where we will select expand. Then we will go to the shape builder tool, and by holding down alt, we will erase the edges that come out of the circle. Next we will select unite from the pathfinder. We will create a new ellipse that we will color in orange and send it back. Then, using the created ellipse, we will create two more copies that we will overlap so that a small part of the top remains free. We will select both copies and then go to Pathfinder and select Divide. We will ungroup and keep only the top that we will color in white. The rest will be deleted. Then we will go to Transparency and select Overlay after which we will change the opacity to 42. We have one more thing to do which is to create a pattern of points to put over our basketball. We will create a small ellipse on the left that we will multiply using Alt plus Shift and then Ctrl plus D to make more copies. After making the pattern we will select everything in group. Then we place the pattern over the ball.
Next we will create a new ellipse the size of the ball that we will place above the pattern. Both the pattern and the ellipse will be the same color as the lines of the ball. We will select both the pattern and the ellipse, we will go to the pathfinder and we will select crop and then we will modify its opacity. We will click on line art and select a range and bring to front. I hope this tutorial was helpful. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like, subscribe and click on the notification bell to be notified every time I post a new tutorial. If you want to make a specific tutorial, do not hesitate to write in the comments section.